absolute 2-2 two -two draw with South Melbourne. Do you feel it could have been a bit more though? Yeah, I'm disappointed we didn't come home with the three points. Um, in hindsight, they had a few chances at the end, they could have won it as well. But uh, I suppose if you're a, a, a mutual spectator, you would have loved that game. It had a bit of everything in it. So hopefully we put a good spectacle on for everybody. It was not certainly an end-to-end -end affair. We started to seem to start today a lot quicker. Did you do anything different in the build-up to the game or a different message to the boys? Uh, look, same message. Um, I suppose that uh, we knew you know, South Melbourne would sit on top of the ladder. We knew we had to come out and take the game to them, and uh, the boys did that. Uh, you know, and I think we could have scored three goals before half time and maybe really kill the game off. Um, but look, again, credit to the boys, I'm really proud of them. They did a great job, and uh, uh, we'll move on to next week. Young Christian Jeskeski scoring again. Is he starting to live up to your expectations in, uh, in that midfield position? A lot of expectation there for the young boy, but uh, he's definitely coming to. Uh, what he can do. Um, good little footballer, he's only going to get better, 70 years of age and uh, I think everybody's looking forward to that. Midfield seemed to work really well tonight without uh, the injured captain Nick Hegarty as well. Give you a lot of confidence that you can mix the boys around again if you need to? Of course, uh, I keep saying the last transfer window day, uh, we signed four quality footballers, we've got a 20 man squad and then I'm comfortable chucking anybody into, into, the, into the game and uh, unfortunately we, we're missing Hags today, our captain and uh, He's a very influential footballer, um, but you know, Danny did well. It's his first start in a few weeks, so he'll only get better. Um, you know, we mixed up, we mixed it up a little bit with a few other boys coming on into different positions. But now, look, uh, overall, couldn't have asked anything more. Just a word on the FFA Cup draw yesterday, uh, drawing Marconi Stallions should be a cracking game. Yeah, I hope so. And I hope so. That goes our, our way. Um, we're expecting a tough game. Um, you know, a, a club with uh, a lot of proud history. Um, they've got some really good footballers there as well, and um, but, you know, but they come to our home ground, and uh, you know we're going to try and make it as difficult as we can for them, and hopefully we can uh, progress to the next round.